Okay, we're back um, with um, construction and modeling in the construction phase. Again, I have to uh, give you a few uh, little, um, I have to share with you a few things before we get into this next part, dividing parts with a gap. Two things. One, modeling in the construction phase um, is, is very, very complicated, as you can see. But also, there's another side to this you may be unaware of. Wearing a suit or a nice outfit, a pink shirt, a pink shirt, a pastel shirt on a construction site to a construction meeting, modeling in the construction phase, you'll see what I mean about how modeling in the construction phase allows things to phase. Things will phase when you place a facade on a, in a construction phase. When, when the construction phase construction phase, and you model in the construction phase, things will phase. <laughs> so please, take this with a grain of salt. This, ex this, this class is for three-year-olds. Take this with a grain of salt. I'm just letting you know that jealousy plays a part in this. Jealousy. Modeling in the construction phase. Now, another note about all you uh, YouTubers out there. And this is a direct directive to the politicians, inclusive of the President of the United States. Monetize the platform, I said. Okay? Monetize the platform. I don't care who you are. I don't care who, what bully pulpit you're on. I said, monetize the platform, or else we're fucked. All right, anyway. Hi. Right. Can I at least give you that order? I'm not a general foreman, but I said monetize the fucking platform, for Christ's sakes. Raise the sales tax and cut unemployment incrementally. Jesus Christ, it doesn't take a rocket scientist to figure that out. In any event, half of them are going from cradle to grave on illicit funds anyway. And now it's time to wean them off the teat. It's not rocket science, right? Anyway, read between the lines, monetize the platform. Dividing parts with a gap, a generational gap. In the previous exercise, you learned how to divide parts using datum objects and simple sketches. You also have the ability to divide parts with a defined gap as well as with custom profile, which is cool. Let's explore these options with another exercise. Continue to work with the sample C20 parts start RVT or its metric equivalent uh, from the previous exercise. Activate the parts model 3D view and orbit the model to view the exterior face of the wall. That doesn't mean hang around me and haunt me, man. I mean, don't get me wrong, I take direction, but for Christ's sakes. Enough with the props, the special effects. Fucking woman pulses, for Christ's sake. Ah, I get the point. I get the point. It's psychotropic. It sure is. Make it stop doing what it does all the time. And monetize the platform. Now, yeah, so let's view around so we can see the exterior wall face. Wow, what a trip, huh? What a trip. Hello, Otto. No, no. I can't be reached. I can't be reached. So the exterior wall thing. It needs a shave. It needs a shave. It needs it needs articulation too. But the articulator has been used in the last few uh, weeks. So um, let's just let that go to to wherever it wants to go. And uh, yeah, so let's hover around, orbit around a little bit. You can see the soldier course up there. You see the roof parapet. All sorts of beautiful things here that make up this model. Now, this isn't a home builder that you, you bought from Home Depot. <laughs> this isn't QuickBooks, per se. It's QuickBooks, but it's not. It's not, it's something else, something else. Again, I, I'm, you know, they have, I, I'm trying to find my place, where, where I fit in this whole building information modeling spectrum. And the more and more I do it, the more I realize maybe I don't. All right, so if that's the case, I'll exclude myself. I'll exclude myself from it. Now, 
Now that we've hovered around and we've orbited and that we can see um, <coughs> the, uh, the wall, the exterior of it, <coughs> select the main part of the exterior wall that has material sign concrete precast. Click the divide parts tool in the contextual ribbon. So we have this concrete precast, or precast, panels. Right? Now we only we have one panel here, two, three, four, five, six. So let's just hover around until we can uh, uh, select one. Select the main part of the exterior wall face that has material sign of concrete. Well, they all probably do. Right? In this case, they all do. Right? Precast panels. Concrete plank. My father used to work for that. Concrete plank. He used to work for Bethlehem Steel, too. Anyway, he's old school. Old school. He drove a tank through a pineapple field in Hawaii. Okay. Sorry, waxing nostalgia. Just a little bit of that may sprinkled in. Sprinkled in. For ha-has. Okay, so, yeah. In the properties palette, set the divider gap parameter to one inch. In the properties palette, select the divider gap to one inch. In the properties palette, select the divider gap to one inch. I'm looking. I'm looking. I don't see that parameter unless I'm blind as a bat. I'm not seeing it. I'm not seeing it. I'm not seeing it. Again, I'm in the model. Am I missing it? Maybe it'll pop back up when I look over here. Sometimes these synchronized models do shit like that. In the properties palette. Oh, well that's because I'm waxing nostalgic again. You know me. Oh, this guy. <laughs> Deficit disorder. Yeah. He wants to relax and talk about something else sometimes. 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 Because I don't. Right? I go to these companies and, and all they do is I can talk about their wine cellars and this, 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 this. And I was like, you know what? I'll just shut up and let you talk. I'll just shut up and let you talk. Because I'm trying to work anyway. And you're talking all the time. So if you want to talk, talk. I mean, I can't concentrate anyway. So I'm going to say a fucking thing. And they fucking wine cellars. Right, they. Let me tell you. Yeah, let's divide the part first. Then we'll see the... Uh, the divided gap. First we have to divide it, which we shouldn't, right? In essence, state of the union, edit division. All right, so, divide parts. In the properties palette set the divided gap to an inch, or 25 millimeters. Now here's where I just want to show you something real quick. 25, uh, 25 mm. 25 mm, 63 60 fourths of an inch. <whistles> what do you know? Learn something new every day. Very thin line, thin line. Click the intersecting reference tool in the ribbon. Set the filter to all. And then select level two, reference plane, X plane one, and grid one. Let's think about that for a second. Again, back to Euclidean space and back to the grid. Think about grid and floor plane. Think about a grid and elevation. Think about the X, Y reference planes. And you'll start to understand how we're almost, you could say it, yeah, yeah we're, we're, we're taking the Stadler Mars sharpened mechanical pencil and we're basically, all we're doing, if you can see the beauty of that, we're taking the tip and placing it precisely where we want. We, you and I, or me all by myself. In any event, this is more about me than it is about you. Trust me, this is more about me. I'm real, 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 real self-centered <sighs> this time. I have my best interest in mind. Because Lord knows, my, all these, uh, Folks that profess to care about their employees. <laughs> Where's the bottom line? Yeah. So let's set it to X, Y, uh, X plane one and grid one. Intersecting references. Show all. AWL. 
reference plane, X plane one, and uh, grid one. Right? Right. Turn off the lights. Okay. So apply, hit OK. Now, I just want to see something. Spin a second. Click the green check mark in the room. Finish divide parts mode, and the panel will be divided with a continuous gap. Now, again, this is where you know how you have to use the right hand rule, and hopefully, I didn't get disorientated thinking about my uh, infirm father. So let me just do this. Nothing will be divided. Ah, isn't that a profound statement? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Indivisible. Clarity and justice for all. Here we have. Is Kaepernick going to get another job in the NFL? Is the NFL going to appease him? Or has the NFL actually uh, looked back and uh, 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 seen the error of their ways? Now, interesting. If indeed Kaepernick gets reinstated, which could very well be, he seems like a relatively simple individual, but making a point, maybe some may think that he committed career suicide. But here's the caveat to that. Now, during the national anthem, when they instill this new anthem, if a white individual kneels down during that, is that going to be a problem, right? You see, there's a, or if a police officer or if a federal agent or the President of the United States decide to kneel down or leave his hat on during this, what are the ramifications going to be? See how, how life will spin you? Like it just spun me. And that's what's going on, on the, at the rudimentary fun stage with the folks that haven't reached this civilization yet. All trying to make a fucking statement. What's that Billy Joel song? I used to have a, uh, um, like a point of view at, what's the old adage? Pointless point of view. A pointless point of view. Like the one I just per uh, performed. Select the main exterior wall. Select the main part. And click the divide parts tool. Set the gap to one inch. Could, could very well be that 164th may have made a difference. Could have made a difference. One inch. You test it. This is these are hypotheses that you have to. Hypothesis is educated guess. You have to. That's how you have to learn the software. Hypothesize. Now, yeah. Uh, in that particular instance, uh, we went through it, and nothing would be divided. Uh, and again, the only thing I'm. Well, the first thing I'm thinking is. Uh, that 164th of an inch could make a difference, but I doubt it. We're just going to have to see what was the, uh, the glitch. Uh, now, click the intersecting references tool in the ribbon. Intersecting references, plain tool in the ribbon. And then set the filter to all. The filter to all. And then select level two. Oh, I'm so stupid. Well, that's what I get. That's what I get. Attention deficit disorder. When you've got so much on your mind, and I've gone through, let's see, 51 years, probably around, you figure I got the paper boy job when I was around 14. So you figure around, uh, let's just rough it up to about 45 years, 40 years, 35 years of work, you know? And uh, I was able to continue working with all stressors, uh, trying focus without having life get in the way, right? Life gets in the way sometimes. And uh, that's what you have to learn. Life will get in the way of work. Um, so a happy balance is uh, what I'm trying to achieve as far as uh, that and nonchalance. But I love the trade and the industry so much that uh, I'm the only one to blame for my current state of mind and my current state of being. So on my person uh, <coughs> is some uh, some uh, speed bumps. So if you're wondering why I, I behave in the manner that I do, and I do. But again, we all do. And if you have the luxury of not having to worry about much, then uh, hopefully you're, uh, you're, uh, you're right there with me in a state where you're worrying a little less about those
those others and, and more about yourself. <laughs> Sometimes you say to yourself, oh, so that's what I was doing. I was worrying about everybody but me. All right, well, what are you going to do? You live in your arm. Hindsight's twenty twenty. Okay, so now that I realize that I selected the wrong level, that's always going to be a problem. Nothing will divide if um, indeed that's the case. Let's see, maybe, maybe it's more than that. Maybe there'll be another solution that I have to uh, figure out. So, uh, yeah, so um, hit apply. I said, okay. Double check my math because I did DV from center again. Right, 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 right. Level two, reference plane X, Y panel. Oh, there's three. There's three. <laughs> IBW local three. The holy trinity. Holy shit, Batman. They come in threes. They come in threes. All right, so let me hold that thought. What else do I have, what else do I have on my mind? Well, I have uh, 316 Saturday. You know, I, I got I got some I got some chopped meat in the fridge. Make a burger, blue cheese, some Frank's hot sauce. I was thinking about making. Uh, but again, I'm trying to get down to 200 pounds even. So uh, I want to see how uh, how the construction industry treats me when I wear a pink shirt to a coordination meeting and act all fancy uh, at 200 pounds as opposed to fat, bald, and toothless wearing a pink shirt at 50 years old and at <coughs> that particular perspective I want to see how I get treated in the field it's an experiment it's an experiment I hypothesize it'll be different you'll see people are very very easily manipulable I monetize the platform I said okay nothing will be divided no errors, but two warnings. Let's, let's read through. Two warnings may be ignored. These parts were not intersected by any references. They will not be divided. Warning two. Parts ID 181.265. Well, hmm. Nothing will be divided. That's a very uh, profound statement. It's a very profound statement. Let's read through this and double check. All right, so, um, yeah, I, this is a long video. This has been going a while. Um, so, yeah, we, we're going to put in some, uh, some nice um, gaps for this uh, prefabricated uh, concrete panel wall. And we have profiles that we utilize almost um, in a brick face type of scenario where you apply stucco, uh, scratch coat, down trowel, and then the brick coat. And then you have different styles of, of, uh, of profiles that you can etch into the wall to give you different uh, aesthetically, uh, aesthetically pleasing looks, up angles, and all sorts of different uh, divisions that you can uh, utilize. And these profiles, and they behave the same way, uh, that these sweeps do. So let's just uh, hold that there. Again, uh, this is a little bit about me, a little bit about you, a little bit about the industry. And I'm going to stop, right? And I'm not going to beat myself up over it. And then I'm going to go make a cheeseburger. Sounds good. With crumpled blue cheese. Maybe you throw want onions on it? No, no, no. Just crumpled blue cheese and Frank's hot sauce. What are you doing today? What are you wearing? 